In this lesson, we're going to learn the names of the black keys on the piano keyboard. Now, unlike the white keys on the piano keyboard, the black keys can have two names, depending on where it is in relationship to the white keys. For example, let's take a look at this group of two black keys. And let's take a look at the first black key. If you see, you can see here, it's surrounded by two white keys, C and D, which we learned in the earlier lessons. Now, because it's to the right of C, we call it C sharp. And because it's to the left of D, we can also call it D flat. So again, here's this black key. It's to the right of C, so it's called C sharp. Or it's going up from C, so it's called a sharp. Now, if it's to the left of D, or it's going down from D, it's called a flat. So we call that D flat. Let's look at the next black key right here, and we'll see it's surrounded by D and E. So because it's going up from D, we call it D sharp. And because it's also going down from E, we can also call it E flat. Let's go ahead and name the rest of the black keys. So here's a group of three black keys. Here's the first black key in that group. And that's right, it's surrounded by F and G. So that's right, it's called F sharp because it's going up from F, and it's called G flat, also because it's going down from G. Let's look at the next black key, right here. It's surrounded by G and A. So that's correct. This one is called G sharp, because it's going up from G. And also, it can be called A flat, because it's going down from A. And now, let's look at this last black key. Here's A, here's B. Those are two white keys that surround it, so that's correct. This is A sharp because it's going up from A, and this is B flat, also B flat right here, because it's going down from this note, B. And there it is. Um, stay tuned for our next lesson.